Hi everybody, Allie Prick here for Startup Girls Club and on this week's episode of Passion. It is a question I get asked often and that is, I am not a cheerleader style personality. So how in the world do I share my passions with others? You know, social media, blessing and curse that it is, you see people who are so energetic and so passionate and they're just so bubbly and so cheesy corny, but they can pull it off. And it's just like, you look at them and you're like, well, that's great. That's not me. I'm not like that. But yeah, I am passionate about what I do. And I know I'm damn good at it. But because I'm not like, yeah, whoa, like, and that's not me. No one knows that, right? Well, yes. And no. Yes, the fact that people who are just scrolling and looking at a Facebook ad and they're seeing a video that looks corny, cheesy, gross, or weird, of course, that's just natural instinct that they're going to stop and play it. But that doesn't mean that that person has more passion than you. It means that they're willing to be more showy than you. Passion isn't about being a spectacle. Passion is that fire that burns because you can feel people when they have that passion. You can be around someone and you can feel their heart and their energy. And yet you can just also be around people who just act like a crazy cheerleader who has no passion, but they just like to be loud and be noisy. Those are different things. So it's totally okay that you don't want to be or you are not that outspoken cheerleader S type. Be true to what your passion is and how the world that comes up for you. Because there's more people out there who are going to relate to maybe the calmer, more reserved, but yet very fiercely passionate beliefs than someone who's going to relate to the spectacle style of life. And in the end, you don't want to be the spectacle. You want to be the person that helps bring forth world change, helps bring forth other people's passion and creativity, and helps create connection. And sometimes spectacle doesn't do that in the long term of life.